Hi guys, welcome back or welcome if you're new. Today is Vlogmas day number 11 and happy Saturday. All right guys, so first and foremost, I wanna share this breakfast I made, so here you go. Hey guys, so here's the breakfast that I cooked this morning. I just made boiled eggs. I don't eat yolk, I only eat egg whites. A BLT on regular toast. And here I made a mimosa and I put in some grenadine, which is just some red syrup. I love how it goes from sunset to, look at that. That is so beautiful and it tastes really good as well. But guys, watch this boy. Look at him. Can't do nothing without him. Look at him. Too much, guys. But I really enjoyed it. And after I ate breakfast, you know, I had to get some things done. So we're going to just talk about my day and how comfy it was and how I really just enjoyed myself just being lazy and lounging all day. With that, guys, I want to take a moment to share some really sad news with you guys. If you don't know what happened today, I have the footage for you to see. Yeah, this is so sad. Prayers for all the these families Friday, and all these people in all these Saturday, states. Uh, morning. A rescue and recovery mission mm, is ongoing. Mm, Hundreds mm, of mm. thousands of people have been left without power across Arkansas, this is so Illinois, sad. Kentucky, Missouri, Mississippi, and Tennessee. Now, initial reports on one of the tornadoes suggest that it is tracked uh, as far as 250 miles, which would mm. ocean. It'll be only the second time since 1950 that a tornado of such strength and magnitude has been recorded. In 250 the last two miles. Of the year. This may be the year. worst one. This is an extremely rare event for this time of year, for the month of December. Look it at all this. comes Look at, at the end of one of the most devastating mm -mm -mm. years on record. For climate disasters yep. in the United States. Guys, that is so sad. I wish that people would really understand how serious climate change really is and how important it is for us to start paying attention. With that being said, I would just like to take a moment of silence for all six of those states and all those people who now have to deal with that before they go into a new year. So let's give them a moment of silence, guys. sending out all prayers and condolences to everyone that lost a family member and even if you did not lose a family member thank god you still have your life however i understand and my heart is with you for all that you're gonna have to go through to rebuild your life so sending prayers and condolences to everybody in those six states all right guys so yes happy saturday so you know i'm all about self-care right we must give ourselves self-care sometimes we're always on go, 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 and we don't relax. We also put these heavy, heavy, heavy beams on our back to make us carry. So with today being Saturday, as you've seen the title was Comfy Saturday. This is me, this is me comfy. On the couch, this is me just relaxing. And the greatest gift that I gave myself today was the grace to relax. I actually allowed myself to relax without making myself feel guilty. And a lot of us don't do that we say we need to relax we know we need to unplug to recharge but yet we don't give ourselves the space for it so if you're looking for a sign here's your sign take your relaxing day it does not have to be saturday it can literally be any day you need but we need to understand that disconnecting is healthier than we think you know we want to stay connected we don't want to miss out everybody has fomo but you ain't gonna miss nothing I'm telling you, if you don't take care of yourself, you'll lose yourself. So give yourself the grace to relax and give yourself the permission. Give yourself the permission. You deserve it. As you guys still hear the dryer going, you know that I am still doing laundry. I told you guys that I started yesterday and I would finish up today. So that's the noise you hear in the background. You guys also know that I have to share with you what I watch. So here you go. Happy Saturday, guys. Are you guys going to be watching any sports? I will be watching the UFC, and I also will be watching the NBA basketball game that comes on tonight, the Warriors against the Sixers. All right, guys. Be back later. Do y'all watch the show? I don't do riddles, but... Love and Marriage, Huntonville, Alabama. This is the reunion. When it comes to you, Kimmy, and Kyla, how 
card games now. Mm. Kimmy, <laughs> how are things with you and Kyra now? Uh, we're a lot better. We're we're a lot better. We um communicate better. You know, we we try. It's a it's a tall mm. task because we okay. never got on. Bye guys. Yes. <laughs> Yes, 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 guys. We are waiting for tip off. And what is your answer to this question? Will Steph Curry break the all time three point record tonight, guys, in Philly? Comment down below and let me know. I'm going to say yes because y'all know I ride with the blue and yellow. So we got this. All right, y'all. We'll be back when the game starts. I can't wait. I'm so excited. I'm watching mad things right now. I know UFC, basketball, a reunion. It works for me. <laughs> Bye, guys. Tip off. And the Sixers got it. All right, y'all. I'm ready for this game. So those are just some of the things that I've watched today to keep myself entertained and just give me a little comfort while I relax. Okay, real real quick. You know, I, you know, I always have to go back, right? All right. Again, one of the words that I want to share with you guys is acceptance. Accept that you are not Wonder Woman or Wonder Man. Accept it. Stop trying to chase after it and stop trying to build yourself up to be it. We are more capable of completing things. I'm sorry. We're more capable of completing things than we think we are, right? But if you burn yourself out, you will have nothing. So accept the fact that you have to rest. I wanted to share that with you. Accept it and do it. That's all that we can do. It's okay to relax. You're don't let anyone badger you don't let your your negative talk in your head say oh my god but you're missing again you're not missing out anything accept it accept that we have to relax we're human beings it is what it is all right guys so what i have for dinner today is so y'all remember how i was talking about i wanted to cook nachos i wanted to put this clip in here just to show y'all how easy it is to just go waste money when you can have a perfect meal in your house. I right, boom. So I want it. So here is all the stuff I need to make tacos. The shells, cheese, sour cream, hot sauce, sauce, lettuce, tomatoes, jalapenos, onions, cilantro, and meat. A whole damn meal in the house. And was gonna go buy more stuff to cook another meal, nonetheless. But still, now that money gets to stay in my pocket. And my game, my game, guys. Okay. Y'all see that real quick? Just like I said in that clip, we have to sometime remember what we have in our house get out that goddamn fast food restaurant stop trying to order uber eats and save yourself a few coins by just finding things in your home that can make you a full meal i was literally about to go out and buy all the ingredients i needed to make chicken nachos if you want to know about my chicken nachos i will link the video right here go watch it that recipe is super easy and they're super delicious but Instead of going out and buying all these new groceries, I had every single thing. And y'all seen how them tacos came out. They were delicious, guys. Freaking delicious. So, guys, that was really my day. I really did not do anything today. I took the time for myself. I made myself comfortable. I helped myself relax. I just did what Tessie wanted to do today. It didn't matter about the to-do list. It didn't matter about anything else outside of what I needed to rejuvenate, what I needed to refresh, and what I just needed to relax, guys. So again, make sure you take the time to relax. Make sure you give yourself the grace, give yourself the permission, and let yourself know that it's okay to accept the fact that you're goddamn tired. We get tired. 
who the hell can work all the time and do things all the time and not get tired also another thing if you're like me who takes everything to a mental place your brain needs to take a breather you need some water you need some sleep you need some relaxation and you just need some quietness man you have to quiet your brain you have to take your mental health more serious than you are we're living in a different age where you don't have to be embarrassed anymore you damn sure should not be ashamed of saying i need a mental health break and if that takes a day if it takes two weeks if it takes three to six months it does not matter because what happens is you gain so much strength sitting in that and giving yourself the time to do what you have to do than you would by continuously running behind something else because it's supposed to make you strong. That word strength, that word strong has been used and abused. It has been stretched out to limits that it's not, everything is not about you staying strong. <laughs> everything is not about you staying strong. And just because you have a moment of relaxation does not make you weak. It doesn't guys. We need to let go of some of those narratives. We need to understand that we're not robots. And even a robot, even a computer, even electronics, guess what they do? They die, they die. And when they die, they need what? They need to be plugged back in so that they can be recharged. It is the total opposite for us. When we are zooped in our battery, we need to unplug so that we can recharge. We need to disconnect so that we can move forward. You cannot constantly keep running yourself ragged. It is not going to work. It may feel good right now. It may help you feel that you're moving forward on your goals and you know, helping you get things that you have planned done. Yes, that is true. But I'm telling you, if you do not give yourself the space, you won't have anything. Forget what you can give to people. It's all about what you can give to yourself. So guys, I enjoyed my Saturday. I hope that you guys enjoyed your Saturday. Really quick video, not much to really talk about because I wanted to relax. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching my video. I can't believe that we're in Vlogmas Day 11. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.